Here we are at Kingfield, uh, working about to uh, play Dartford, one of the biggest games of the season. We're expecting a crowd of 2,500, maybe even 3,000 today, and Woking are riding high at the top of the Blue Square South. Just over a year ago, we are in the lower half of the Blue Square South. Uh, we're out of the cup, uh, didn't quite know what the future held for the club, and uh, then this happened. Elvis hammered and he hooks it back and Animal is there, the Murta and Woking have a third. Goes round the last defender, Hammond! It's Elvis Hammond away here, Elvis Hammond with the strike and Joe Munoni could be in now and he finds the bottom corner in there and he could fall to Adimola. Oh. Just to play it into the back post and Adam Doyle's there. Oh, he's Adimola, Adimola with the shot and Hammond could get in behind Stephen Robinson here and he flicks it past Jordan into the back of the net. Burgess looks to let one fly, oh what a beauty! Oh and he's shot into the post. Oh, the Dale bin. And King will find Elvis Hammond from Moses Animola. Oh, he's out of the line. Hammond's there and walking, but it's Joe McNerney. I say, but it could come to Animola. Hammond, it's Elvis Hammond. And off bins and he'll pick out Gray. And, and here's Paris Cowan Hall. Oh, awkwardly, and it could come to Moses Animola. It's Paris Cowan Hall. Oh, but Jay Davies is there. Oh, and it's Moses Animola. But he moves around the defender. Oh, what a goal. And now so and walking hair and then ins and walking have four. Catch on to this and he's into the area. Gray with the effort. And it's Paris Cowan Hall. Oh, I feel talky. And it's Dale Bins. And walking. it's still Elvis Hammond. Oh, that's delightful. Dip into the area. And I'm Doyle. Oh, and Cowan Hall could be away here. And we'll play the wall into Wayne Gray. Oh. Danny Merlin will fly to Dean. Alan Hintz is up there. Follow with the corner. Doyle with the head. Advantage and it's Elvis Hammond trying to win the header. Elvis Hammond with the shot and then ends with the header and he goes all the way through. And Jack King is there. Off of Elvis Hammond. Uh, Medley with the cross. And Imola is there. Early corner for Woking to the back post and Alan Ings is up there and Woking take the lead after just three minutes. So it's been an absolutely fantastic uh, change of fortunes. It's been a brilliant, brilliant season and obviously we're confident we're riding high in the division. Gary Hill and Steve Thompson have made a huge difference. Huge difference. The players have made a huge difference. The board have made a big difference. The staff have played their part. The academy are playing their part. But also we as fans have actually played a huge part in this change of fortunes. And a key part of that has been boost the budget. Uh, when we thought of boost the budget, we thought it would be a great idea just to give people an opportunity to help add value to the playing squad, help show our commitment for getting Woken back to where it belongs. And it has exceeded our expectations. We, on a conservative level, we've added £750 a week to the playing budget to add quality to what we see on the pitch. And we're seeing the benefit. The club is pulling together. Everyone's on the same page. We as fans have made a difference and Boost the Budget has been part of that. Our message today is quite simple. We want to finish the job for this season, but then push on for next. I'm very pleased, of course, like any manager would be, to hear you know, the supporters there in respect of boost the budget. And of course, at the end of the day, uh, any help going forward is appreciated. Hello, I'm Gary Richardson. It's been a fantastic season for Woking Football Club. Most weeks, win, 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 win. Let's push on. Let's go up. Let's boost the budget. We're on the verge of something brilliant. Boost the budget. Come on. I'm Frank. I am Kevin. I am Robert. We're from Holland. This is our uh, fifth time here at Kingfield. We love Woking. We are proud to be here. So you have boost the budget, so we can play. We can get more players here. I'm Steve. Uh, Woking supporter for the last five seasons. Everyone who comes through the gate should be boosting the budget at least ten pound per month. Come on, you can't. So Casey, do you contribute monthly to boost the budget? Boost the budget. Just do it. So from now on, from the Welling game at home to the end of the season, every home game is going to be a table at the Woking ground. And we're just asking fans, if you're already supporting Boost the Budget, please carry on. If you're in a position to be able to add mate, a little bit to that, maybe five or ten pound a month, again, that will make a huge difference. If you're not supporting Boost the Budget yet, that's absolutely fine. But if you can afford to, please do sign up because you know every small every small amount makes a big difference. We've contributed as fans approaching thirty thousand pounds this season. We're now the second largest shareholders in the club, so it does make a big difference. And I know it makes a big difference on the pitch. We've also got bucket collections at uh, the Tunbridge game, so please give generously at that. And uh, anything you can contribute um, will be a huge help. So thank you very much. Let's boost the budget. Let's push on. Let's finish the job.